master. No. <laughs> Sorry, master. How many times have I told you, Renfield? You feed me one more cup of tomato juice and I will throw it in your face. Master, I... I don't want excuses! I want fresh blood. I am trying, Master, but the paper boy got wise to my traps. <coughs> Dad, you promised to be careful. Do I need to spell it out for you? M-O-B. I am Count Dracula, not Spell Dracula. M-O-B spells angry peasant mob howling for your dust. I know that, but I'm bored. Vladdy, tomorrow you shall stay home from school and entertain me. Invite your village friends over. Hmm. You can play murder in the dark. For the last time, no. If you need entertaining, get a TV. You want me to stare at a glass box all day? I'd rather be dead. And I am. <laughs> And I love it. No television, and that's final. If we get to do evil stuff, I'll stay home with you. Then it's settled. I shall buy a television. You, go barter with the peasants for their finest television. And you, clear up this mess. Why can't Vlad do it? It's because he's a boy, isn't it? No. It's because he's my son. He's my future, my hopes, my dreams. He is... Going round to Roberts. Then I'm going too. And you can't stop me. Fine. Fine! Just remember to polish my coffin when you get home. I can't believe you talked me into another vampire staker. We're slayers. It's our duty to fight the forces of darkness. And... Shh. They're coming out. Off to commit evil deeds, no doubt. Or maybe they're just going to hang out with mates. What a great idea. Oh, no. You're in Vlad's class. You must befriend him, gain his trust. One day the mask will slip and then it's out with the garlic and steaks. You want me to invite him around for dinner? Sometimes I think your heart just isn't in the slaying business. Of course it is, Dad. It's just that... What if I was to try and get close to Ingrid instead? I knew you were a chip off the old stick. Hey, Robin. Do you want to smell my flower? Do I look stupid? Just play along. We're trying to win you've been shamed. You could be on telly. Great. I'm gagging to embarrass myself in front of my friends. <laughs> <laughs> How many times? You <laughs> haven't got any friends. Robin, your friends are here. Ingrid! Knew you couldn't keep away. Ignore the freak. We're gonna make you a star. What do you mean, make? You know the TV show, You've Been Shamed? No. Oh, well, people make funny movies and send them in. The top prize is a thousand pounds, and we're gonna win it. With you as our leading lady. Have either of you two clowns ever made a movie before? We've been creating movies for years. Yeah? They mean they filmed our family holidays on Dad's clapped out old camcorder. Our cinematic masterpieces. Ten years of browner holidays. Mirtha Tidville? Want to breathe? Oh, I forgot about this one. Transylvania. What? what? 1994. Holiday in Bistritz, Transylvania. That's just a few miles from our old castle. I don't remember going to Transylvania. I was years ago. Put it on. Put it on. Spielberg must be panicking so much right now. I can't believe I've been to Transylvania never knew. You're so lucky to have lived there. I'd give anything to switch lives with you. That's it. What? You don't fit into your family. I don't fit into mine. I was in your village when I was a baby. What if me and you were like accidentally swap round. Look, I know you think you don't fit in, but that's just because you're an individual. Not because you're a Vlad. A Vlad. It would explain a lot, though. Well, I'm convinced. When are you moving out? Master, why don't you let me entertain you? Because I don't think I could survive yet another hour of your Transylvanian twist. Mm, you sure? Eh? 
I've made a new sparkly leotard. Now, let's see what mindless trash passes for entertainment these days. Up a bit. Left a bit. Just right. Master, I think you should know that I am in agonizing pain. Perfect. Hold it there. Fantastic. You got the TV. We're finally normal. No son of mine is normal. Vlad, you're banned from watching this thing. It'll turn you into a weak-willed, sheep-like native. Ingrid, you can watch it if you like. I hope you get hooked on that breather box. It'll have no effect on me. I am incorruptible. Watch this. Boring. 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 Morning, Dad. Dad. Good old blood-free toast. The perfect breakfast. Has he been watching TV all night? Looks like it. Okay, Dad, I'm off to school. Bye, Dad. Bye, Vlad. See ya. Chill here. My wife and I have waited a long time for this moment. I thought you were incorruptible. Shh. Quiet. Sheila is about to find out if Edna is really her daughter. Well, doesn't she know? Of course not, you foolish girl. She has amnesia. Here are the results of your DNA test, Mrs. Scott. I'm sorry to tell you, Edna is not your daughter. <gasps> However, I am your son. Oh. Oh. <laughs> well, I didn't see that one coming. Of course not. Because it's really far-fetched and stupid. Oh, just go to school, Ingrid. I don't believe this. You love that TV more than your children. Mm, of course I don't. Just love TV more than my daughter. Have you eaten plenty of garlic? Yes, Dad. Good. And what do you say if she invites you up to see her coffin? I'm not that sort of boy. Can I go now? Wait. I got your bees. You're a slayer now, my son. Yeah. Thanks. <laughs> 